Here is another instance in which I used four different search engines and the cached capabilities of each to try to find a missing page. I was looking here on dig.us, which combines some of the delicious popular bookmarks with Slashdot and Dig, came across this Google Worldwide Search, geotargeted search comparisons. I wanted to take a look at that. However, when I clicked on that, I received a page not found error message. The site was down for some reason. So, quickly taking the URL from that page, I took a look over at ask.com this time. After the ads, I found I got nothing. Transferring that with my bookmarklets to Google, I also found no um, listing of this. It must be a fairly recent site and had not been indexed by at least two of the search engines, neither Ask nor Google. Well, let's try going over to one of the, the other two big ones. And of course, the third one I went to was Yahoo and yet again um, found nothing in the results. Now, lest you get discouraged at this point of checking three, my hunch too was that uh, going to the fourth large search engine, live.com, would end up with another zero results. But I did check anyway, and this time I hit pay dirt. Not only was the site indexed at live search, but they had a cached copy of the web page. Clicking on that brings up the results indexed on the 20th of September. This, by the way, was a search that I did on September 23rd. So three days hence, none of the other search engines had gotten this yet and certainly did not have the cache copy. And here, um, this page worked fairly well. It still had the ads, but it did have the content that I was looking for to see what this page is all about. Once again, I find this as a great reason to search more than just at Google or any one single search engine, but if you don't find what you're looking for, take a look at the others and remember each of the search engines may have a different edition of the page in their cache if all four of them actually even have the page.